brush. Okay, okay. Turn it up. Oh boy, we made it. Yeah. That's oh, me, man. <laughs> 7 11 2020 wow this is uh this is really special um oh, a year man. ago a year and change when i proposed to ashley i did no not way. know what was in store for the next oh my God. Months. <laughs> six months in we're like oh man this wedding is gonna be grand huge we had everything planned to see and then life hit and we had to adjust and the last four months were definitely difficult just with all the uh everything that was going on and trying to plan and make it work and make it beautiful but with every every long walk that we were taking during our quarantine every tear that was shed when one thing was lost and we had to make another adjustment and another and another i think these past four months really have been the best for me and Ashley just growing together as a couple even more. And so, Ashley, I just want to say I love you so much and thank you. I know I was uh, trying to be the rock during these last four months saying everything is going to work out. It's going to be the most beautiful day. And that's the way it turned out. The love that's in this room is is amazing each and every one of you i thank you so much for being a part of our lives every single person here has touched us in the most amazing way the foundation that we built because of what was built by all of you and everything that you guys have taught us i just know that we're gonna last forever because of it and so i want to thank everyone that's here for being such a special part of our lives and just most importantly, Ashley, I want to thank you so much. I love you so much. You look absolutely beautiful. You're the most amazing bride. This is the most perfect day. And we're, we're going to remember it forever. Man. <laughs> Man, I love you guys so much. <laughs> so great. I met you when I was 19. Oh, I had just sworn off boys. <laughs> and I met you. I met you and your smile and your warmth. Even six years later, I still feel your warmth. And it feels like we have some kind of secret. It feels like a secret because I can't imagine being able to share this kind of love with someone else. And somehow still, you are everything I couldn't imagine because I didn't know it's possible to be loved like this. Smash, Ash, Ashley, I love you and you could not be more perfect in this moment. About six and a half years ago, we met in a college country bar of all places. In that moment, I didn't know I was shaking my future wife's hand, but if I had, I would have held on just a little bit longer, just a little bit tighter, and if I could, freeze time just so I could look deeper and longer into your eyes and see all the joy six and a half years of being with you would bring me and experience it all at once. You once asked me what it is you brought to me. Well, my answer is this. You give me life, Ash. You're the air in my lungs, the blood in my veins, and the passion in my soul. I wasn't living until I met you and you make me feel like I could live forever.
Ooh. <laughs> so when I first met Ashley, it was oh, Thanksgiving. Yeah. A couple of days earlier, Kevin had called me and he says, Mom, mind if I bring a friend to Thanksgiving dinner? I said, of course, Kevin. So Kevin shows up with this beautiful young woman, Ashley. And I thought, who is this? <laughs> Because here's the first secret Ashley probably doesn't know. Kevin never brought any girls home. This was the only girl he had ever brought into. He said, hi, I'm Ashley. And I said, okay. And she says, well, where can I put my things? So I thought, things? <laughs> well, Kevin failed to tell me they would be there for several days. <laughs> Not just Thanksgiving. When I went into panic mode, oh my god, oh my god, this is my future daughter-in-law. I have the house is not clean. Where is she going to sleep? Uh no, you're not sleeping in the same room. No, 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 no.